are going to do the comparison of isothermal and adiabatic expansion by graphical method. But before that, we need to know two things. For adiabatic process, for adiabatic process, we can draw a conclusion that is P V gamma is a constant. So the product of P and V to the power gamma is a constant and it can be written as P proportional to 1 by V to the power gamma or you can simply say P is inversely proportional to V to the power gamma. Let's consider it to be equation number 1. Similarly, for isothermal process, for isothermal process, another conclusion can be drawn that is P V is equal to constant that is the product between the product of pressure and volume is constant in case of isothermal process and we can write P proportional 1 by V that is pressure is inversely proportional to the volume right. So these are the two cases for uh, adiabatic and isothermal process. Now let me draw a graph that is pressure volume graph for both of them. The pressure volume graph for isothermal and adiabatic process is like this in y axis we need to consider pressure in uh, x axis we need to consider volume right so this is the initial condition this is initial condition the pressure volume curve for isothermal process is like this that is as the volume increases the pressure decreases but on the other hand, the pressure volume work of the pressure and volume curve for adiabatic process is like this. That is, it is more steeper than that one. This is for isothermal process, isothermal process. And we know that for isothermal process, the change in internal energy is zero and the change in temperature is also zero. And this is for adiabatic process adiabatic process and for adiabatic process the change in heat energy will be zero that is there won't be any there, there won't be any exchange of heat energy between the system and surrounding in case of adiabatic process so these are the two curves that we get uh, if we plot pressure against volume for isothermal and adiabatic process for isothermal process the change in internal energy of the system will be zero Similarly, the temperature change will also be zero. But in case of adiabatic process, temperature must change. The temperature changes, but only the uh, heat energy between the system and the surrounding is zero. We can see here the curve of adiabatic process is steeper than the curve of isothermal process. The reason for that is in isothermal process, there will be the exchange of heat energy between the system and surrounding while expansion the gas needs some energy or heat energy that it gets from the surrounding surrounding will provide it internal sorry pro, surrounding will provide it the heat energy that it needs for the expansion but in case of adiabatic process it can't get the energy from outside it has to use its own internal energy in order to expand let's write this let me write over here in isothermal process in isothermal process the system the system gets heat energy heat energy from surrounding surrounding to expand to expand but in case of Adiabatic process, adiabatic process, the system can't get, can't get heat and has to use its own internal energy, internal energy in order to expand. And this is the reason why the adiabatic curve is steeper than the isothermal curve as well as also it is observed that it is observed that 
द ड्रॉप इन प्रेसर द ड्रॉप इन प्रेसर इन केस ऑफ एडियाबैटिक प्रोसेस एडियाबैटिक प्रोसेस इज ग्रेटर ग्रेटर दैन आइसोथर्मल प्रोसेस आइसोथर्मल प्रोसेस फॉर सेम वॉल्यूम ऑफ गैस दैट इज यू कैन सी फ्रॉम ग्राफ ओवर हियर द ड्रॉप इन प्रेशर फॉर एडियाबैटिक प्रोसेस इज ऑब्वियसली ग्रेटर दैन इन आइसोथर्मल प्रोसेस इफ वी टेक द सेम वॉल्यूम ऑफ गैस फॉर सेम वॉल्यूम द प्रेशर चेंज विल बी ग्रेटर दैन इन एडियाबैटिक प्रोसेस दैन इन आइसोथर्मल प्रोसेस दिस इज द ग्राफ दैट वी गेट इफ वी प्लॉट प्रेशर अगेंस्ट वॉल्यूम इन दीज टू प्रोसेस एंड वी नो दैट द वॉक डन सिंपली इज द एरिया ऑफ प्रेशर वॉल्यूम कॉल दैट इज दिस एरिया दिस एरिया इज फॉर आइसोथर्मल प्रोसेस एंड दिस मच एरिया इज फॉर एडियाबैटिक प्रोसेस this much area is for adiabatic process then you can compare your sorry you can compare by yourself as well the area of this of whole region that is for isothermal process is greater than the area of adiabatic process then obviously the uh, work done in isothermal process is greater than that in adiabatic process hence hence the work done the work done in adiabatic process adiabatic process is less than less than that of isothermal process isothermal process so by this graphical method we compared the work done in adiabatic expansion and isothermal expansion that is isothermal expansion is requires more work done